Hello and welcome to Server Assist, assisting you in your server journey. In today's video, I'm going to be highlighting budget options in the Austrian and Russian leagues. This is because they've got a long winter break at the moment and some of these players are available at a budget price. Before we get stuck in, welcome all server managers. As usual, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel and tap that notification bell to be alerted about any new videos. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and Reddit. And for more free server content, please check out serverassist.com. Links in the description. If you're not signed up to server yet, then sign up using the link below to get a free limited card. So as I say, today I'm going to be highlighting some budget options in the Russian and Austrian leagues. Previously, I've also done some budget scouting videos on the MLS, Argentinian and Brazilian leagues. So make sure you go back on the channel and check those videos out too. So this is going to be a two-part series for these European players. This is part one, of course. And let's get straight stuck in to the first player. First player I've gone for is Maximilian Hoffman, rapid wing player, defender who can play on the left, right or central of defence. Does mainly play as a centre back though for Rapid Wien. And if we just look at some of his stats for this season, he started 10 games this season and played an average of 81 minutes. In terms of his passing numbers, they're looking pretty good 44 passes per game, accurate passes, which is 84% accuracy. He's also shown some good interceptions and tackles per game as well 1.3 and 1.6. And also, his total duels look impressive as well at 5.9. Now if we just look at a couple of his games where he has impressed, just look at some stats that stand out. In this game he's got a one inception and also three tackles. And also in this game as well he's got a number of ground duels and aerial duels won, which is going to be good for the triple-triple and double-double points. And in this game here, he's had a very impressive high number of passes with a fantastic accuracy as well. He's also had two key passes in this game. And he's had 16 accurate long balls out of 21 attempted, which is very impressive. So in terms of his scores on the SO5, these are all the scores that we've got uh, visibility of at the moment on so rare data. Some good numbers here, some good impressive scores, including a 94 score there as well. So some of these scores do look impressive. Now these did not play as here is because he was injured before the Austrian Bundesliga took a winter break. Now, I think he is back to fitness now though there doesn't seem to be any report of him still being injured from what I can find but as always do your own research so let's have a look at his price then so the limited card you can get for around £3.45 and his rare price is around £132 another player that I've gone for is Daniel Krugovoy of Zenit Petersburg now this guy has actually only started three of the games but I still thought it was worth a look because he is only 23 so a pretty young player and he is getting some minutes for, for Zenit. So he did recently play in this 7-1 thrashing of Spartak Moscow on the 24th of October. He actually got 7-7 seven, seven minutes in this game and he did get an assist in that match as well. He also had four interceptions as well in that match. And some two key passes and also two crosses which were accurate. His pass numbers also looked impressive and 86% accuracy. So more of a punt this one, obviously he's not getting um, regular game time at the minute, he is getting some sub appearance and that sort of thing, but if maybe one to invest in now, who could potentially get more minutes in the future. So let's have a look at some of his scores then, when he has been getting games. So as you can see, some impressive high numbers here. So the, most of these low ones is where he's not really getting many minutes, but when he is getting 90 minutes, or getting close to 90 minutes, He's getting a few better scores, as you can see here from these higher scores. He's also got 100 here as well, which is absolutely fantastic. So price-wise, it's around £3.75 on the limited and £62 on the rare. Like I say, it might be one that could be a potential bargain now. And then if he does get first-team football, you can then choose to keep him or maybe sell him on for a bit of profit. Another player that looks really impressive is Pablo of Locomotive Moscow. 30 year old Brazilian defender who was more of a centre back than a left back really. He started 10 games and as you can see from his heat map here he does like to get up for corners to attempt to try and get a goal. He has scored one goal this season and is averaging 0.8 shots per game which isn't too bad ratio really for a defender. Accurate passes, 38 accurate passes per game, 84% accuracy. There's also shown some fantastic numbers in terms of the interceptions per game, which is 2.3. It's 
tackles looks decent as well at 1.2 and his total duels also looks very impressive at 5.2 ground duels won per game. So in terms of his price on so rare, his limited card is going for around £20 and his rare card is going for around 194 But if we look at his scores, I think these prices look a bag in price. He's got plenty of high numbers here, some fantastic scores, and he looks a fantastic option. Another good option is Dominic Baumgartner of Wolfsberger AC. Defender who can play on the right of defence and of course central defence, but he does generally play as a centre-back. He's only 25, Austrian international. He started 17 for the games for Wolfsberger. He's also been in three Team of the Weeks on Sofa Score. Uh, he's got one goal and also one assist. He's also shown some decent pass numbers, 34 accurate passes per game. And he's also shown some impressive interceptions and tackles, 1.4 and 1.7. In terms of his ground jewels, this looks absolutely fantastic at 7.5 ground jewels won per game. This is obviously going to rack up some triple triple and double double points. So this guy does look very impressive. In terms of his price on so rare, you're looking at £18.95 for his limited and £223 for his rare card. His scores, these are all the scores that are available on so rare data at the moment. Some impressive numbers here, including a 100 score as well against Stem Gratz. So this guy does look a fantastic option. Fairly cheap price as well for a decent defender. Another Austrian Bundesliga player that caught the eye was Gregory Wuffrich of Sturm Graz. 27-year-old Swiss, plays mainly as a centre-back for Sturm Graz. He started 17 games this season, scored two goals and also got three assists as well. So he's very creative and also likes to get a shot on goal as well, this defender. He's also created four big chances as well for his teammates. Accurate pass looks good, 32.8, 80% 80 accuracy. He's also kept five clean sheets in the 17 games that he's played, which is pretty good for the Austrian Bundesliga, because there's usually plenty of goals in that division, so you don't really get that many clean sheets. And his interceptions and tackles also look very, very good. 2.3 interceptions per game and 2.2 tackles. And his duels won also looks fantastic, which 6.3 totals duels won. So this one looks another good option. So in terms of his price on so rare, you're looking at around 1857 for his limited and a 322 for his rare. Scores wise also look impressive as well. Some 90s around this period here. He's also got a 100 score there as well. Some plenty of green numbers there and not many scores below 50. So another very viable option. So another defender that's really caught the eye is Mario Fernandez. 31 year old who plays for CSK Moscow, Russian, who plays on the right back for CSK Moscow. So as you can see from his heat map here, he's a very attacking player. He does like to get really far forward to try and get some um, assists for his teammates and maybe even get a shot on target himself as well. So he started 17 games for CSK Moscow this season. He's had 38 accurate passes, 82% accuracy. He's also averaging one key pass per game and two big chances created. Inceptions is looking decent at one interception per game and tackles per game looks good as well, 1.9 in tackles per game. Total duels won looks good as well at 6.2, total duels won. Now another thing to note as well is that he also does play internationally for the Russian side. So he's going to get some international utility as well from this player. In terms of his price on so rare, it's £26 on the limited and around 308 on the rare but if we look at these scores they speak for themselves really some absolutely fantastic scores here some high hundreds 80s 70s 60s not that many scores really below 50 so this guy looks a fantastic option another good option is zenit petersburg's vyacheslav karavayev 26 year old russian he plays. He can play on the left or right of the defence, but he generally plays on the right, as you can see from his heat map here. Now, he started 13 games for Zenit Petersburg this season, chipped in with two assists as well, and is also averaging 
29.9 accurate passes per game and it also has a fantastic 5 big chances created. His tackle per game looks good at 1.8 tackles per game. So if we look at his price on Sir Rare then, so his limited card is going for around £5.62 and his rare is going for around 141 now if we look at his scores on so rare, some good numbers as you can see, some fantastic numbers here. He has gone through a little bit of a, a poorer spell here, but he has been playing a regular 90 minutes. Now his numbers are still decent, but obviously this form here that he had is looking absolutely fantastic. So if he gets back to these sort of numbers, then these prices are going to look very cheap. So moving on to the midfielders now, and the first one I've gone for is Lauke Prip of Alborg. Danish nationality and is only 24 years old. Now as you can see from his heat map he does like to play all over the pitch and he does also take corners as well for Alborg which is obviously going to help his assist count. Now looking at the game started, he started 14 games, he's actually scored a fantastic 7 goals and he's also got 2 assists. But he's also showing 1.9 shots per game as well which is absolutely fantastic. Pass numbers look decent as well really for an attacking player and is averaging 1.1 key passes per game as well. So these num numbers look very promising and as you can see here from the recent matches he's scored plenty of goals and also got an assist in this game here. So let's have a look at his scores on Surrey. So these are the scores that we've got available at the moment but as you can see there's a lot of good scores and judging by the amount of goals that he's scored and the assists that he's getting and also the shots per game I would expect this guy to be capable of getting plenty more scores in this green area here. In terms of his price you're looking at around £16.51 for his limited and his rare is going for around 266 Final selection this week is Andre Mostovoy of Zenit Petersburg. 24 year old Russian who likes to play on the left wing of the attack. Now this guy has only started 6 games this season for Zenit but he is only 24 still and I think he does have a bright future. Now he's actually scored 3 goals in those 17 appearances, 6 started which isn't to a bad ratio really and if we just look at some of the scores that he's got when he has played a full 90 minutes and he is also a Russian international, so he is the first team player for them as well. When he does play, he's capable of getting some fantastic scores. Like I say, he is only 24, only just 10, 24. If we just have a look at some of the games where he did start, there was a period where he was getting plenty of games for Zenit. And his form looked absolutely fantastic, which was this period here, only in April last year. So as you can see he's had a good run of games here for Zenit and he's actually scored 3 goals in that period as well. So we'll have a look at a couple of stats on these matches in a moment but if we have a look at this more recent game that he played which was the 7-1 thrashing of Spartak on the 24th of October. He's actually scored 2 goals in this game, he played 75 minutes. He had 2 successful dribbles out of 4. And he's also got 28 accurate passes out of 39 which is very good for an, a very, for an attacking left winger. He's also got two key passes in this game and attempted three crosses. His ground duels also look good as well. He's actually won five ground duels out of nine and also two aerial duels out of three. So this guy does look very impressive. And if we just look at this, look at one of these games here where he was on form and getting a few minutes. In this game here, he played 90 minutes. He scored one goal. He had a fantastic 41 accurate passes out of 46. Two key passes and also attempted six crosses. Now his goal threat in this game was absolutely fantastic. He had four shots on target and also one shot blocked. He also attempted nine dribbles, six of them that were successful. And again, his ground and aerial duels also looks very impressive. So when this guy is getting 90 minutes or near to 90 minutes, he is capable of getting some fantastic scores. And, I say, and like I say, he's also a Russian international. So let's have a look at some of his scores then. As you can see, there's some high numbers here. I'm guessing this is when he's got plenty of minutes to show what he can do. These low numbers here will be where he's playing a sub, sub appearances and that sort of thing. So I wouldn't pay too much attention to these scores. But if you can get into the team, get a few more minutes, then this guy looks an absolute steal at these prices. So he's available at £11 on these limited and around 134 on the rare. 
So that was all the selections for today and as I say there will be a part 2 video where I'll be highlighting the rest of the midfielders and also the forwards in the Austrian Bundesliga and the Russian League as well. If you did like any of these players, if you've got your eye on any of these, thinking of buying any, do let me know in the comment section below. And if you did like this video, then please do, do just that and smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and ping that notification bell. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and Reddit and for more free survey content, please check out surreacist.com. Links are in the description. And if you've not signed up to survey yet, sign up using the link below to get a free limited card. Okay, thanks for watching today and I'll see you again soon.